here at Table Cape Lighthouse but um, unfortunately it's so windy right now there's some tulip flower over there and there's some I'm not sure what flower is behind me but it's so windy and so cold at the moment uh, the first time we came here which is in January 2020 it was nice weather but we didn't have the drone back then and today we're back with the drone but it's so windy so I don't think I'm, we, we can send it out oh well I saw this um, Sweetness Cafe in Winyard, so I asked Justin to pull over. Surprisingly, they have pack and cart, um, so I bought myself one. Uh, this is the four pack and tart and slash pie in Tasmania. I have tried. Um, I think Tasmanian people sure love pack and tart. to keep your kid happy find a playground and just let them play to their heart Today it's Monday. Um, Justin is back to work. He's studying part time today, so he already left to the library with Aiden. She's at school too. I am staying in the caravan um, somewhere in Bernie uh, with uh, Eva and Evie. It's ridiculously cold and windy outside. Our caravan is shaking. And we got after Alba and Evie. Yeah, I'm looking after Eva and Evie. Um, I'm going to make a Korean fried chicken today. I made it last time. It's quite successful. So I'm going to make it again. I just learned something a little bit uh, different um, from a different YouTube channel. So I will try that today. So far, this is just um, chicken thigh salt and pepper i'm gonna add a bit of um uh, vinegar the vinegar help to get rid of the smell and then marinate it for two to three hour if uh, i want a faster um, result then i can uh, put it in the microwave for 30 to one minute and then uh, i don't have to wait for the marinade but then since i have time um i'm gonna make this for lunch so i still have time right now so i will just uh, marinate it uh, the normal way
are drinking coffee like this just ground coffee mixed with um, the powdered milk and then coconut uh, sugar I find coconut sugar make the coffee um, creamy um, fatty um, not sure how is um, how to describe it but it actually tastes really good um, I know that um, somewhere along the way where we go um, to South Australia NT and WA um, they might not have my instant favorite uh, Malaysian coffee that I always drink um, so I want to try something new and I actually uh, try this um, and I really like it um, I really like the creamy um, coconut tea taste in the coffee and sometimes um, I add a little bit of salt so it, um, it takes a little bit salty and it's also because the saltiness uh, bring out the flavor of the coffee as well well um, yeah um, anyway I have spent um, most of my morning um, cleaning up the car van cleaning up the kitchen unpack everything uh, I did the laundry yesterday and I think our washing machine took a lot of water um, so, uh, we can do off with because we have the lithium battery that can convert it into electricity so we can do laundry when we're off with but uh, the downside bit is the washing machine that we have I don't know why it took so much water um, I think one wash is can take can took us like 100 liter which is very strange um, so yeah um, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do the washing when we're doing off with um, right now Justin um, went to Bernie shop um, to pick up a few grocery uh, we're running out salt oil and um, Eva she said she want to eat pasta so he got her going to bought that too only EV left in the car van with me and she's she has been very good she just um, lying on bed watching her iPad while I do um, cleaning up and washing um, the car van is all good now we are ready to leave when Justin come back we will hitch up and go um, we decided uh, that we're gonna um, go back to Cradle Mountain. There's a few mini bushwalking I would like to do. Um, we are leaving um, Tasmania in less than two weeks time and I haven't seen a warm bed which is very disappointing. So I'm thinking if we go back to Cradle Mountain and we do one of those mini walk, we might able to see the warm bed, who knows. Um, but yeah, we only um, did the Dolph Light walk um, the other day and we didn't do anything else then we left to Stanley so yeah now we're gonna go back because we are in Bernie which is not very far from um, Cradle Mountain anyway sort of like a ram so it's not a big job We 
are going to do a walk today. Um, the Champagne walk is about one hour and 45 minute return. Just go to see the waterfall. It's going uphill already. I love you too. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Why are you going backward? Because you walk backward. No, you're supposed to walk. Another uphill section. Waterfall. Um, we just flip the coin because um, both of the waterfall, the champagne or the bridal, they look so good and the time is I think the same or maybe the bridal just a little bit longer uh, but yeah we flip the coin and then bridal fall it is. On our way to um, the camping site um, I saw a wombat stood under the tree on the roadside. Unfortunately, we could not stop on time uh, for me to capture the wombat on video or pictures. Um, we're on a sort of like highway, so there's nowhere for us to stop. Oh, the wombat. I want to see it again. Into the sky. <laughs> been raining lately or something <sighs>
a few water hole here. Uh, unfortunately, we came a bit too late. Uh, today is actually the temperature is not that um, hot. But if we do come here on a, a hot day, I think we can actually sit here and enjoy the water. Right now, the water are like ice cold. Um, so we have complete our bridal view track. Now we are going home. We won't have time to do the champagne walk, unfortunately, but yeah, that's enough exercise for us today. This is our new home for the next two nights. Camp by the lake, which is what I always wanted. We're gonna do the campfire tonight. And there is a platypus in this lake. Uh, I just spot one when we came back. Uh, a bit far away, I couldn't capture it on time. But yes, there is platypus. And there's a lot of camper here, not just us. Like There is many other people. And on this section, we have about Four, uh, four camper here and on that side there is a lot so busy here there's so many people so for dinner now tonight uh, what are you cooking chef Justin? Uh, butter chicken butter chicken? oh your favorite Uh, I think it's more your favorite. Gonna have a smoke.